Demystifying Levels of Formality in Academic Writing Hello, dear learners. Today, we'll dive deep into the world of academic writing. Have you ever wondered why certain texts sound so official and others more relaxed? This is often due to their level of formality. In this video, we'll focus on understanding levels of formality in academic writing. Let's get started. Formality refers to the degree of seriousness and objectivity in a piece of writing. In academic writing, maintaining a certain level of formality is crucial. Why? Because academic works aim to convey information and arguments clearly, reliably, and without personal bias. The tone and choice of words play a significant role in achieving this. Formality in academic writing. 1. Ensures clarity. When you are formal, you are precise. This ensures your readers understand your message. 2. Projects authority. A formal tone conveys that the writer has knowledge about the subject. 3. Keeps the focus on the content. Casual or colloquial language might divert attention from the core message. 4. Promotes objectivity. Formal language reduces emotional language, promoting unbiased presentation of facts. There are generally three levels of formality. 1. Formal. Used in scholarly articles, theses, reports, and research papers. Avoids contractions, slang, and colloquialisms. Always uses third-person perspective. 2. Example. The results indicate a significant correlation between variable X and Y. 3. Semi-formal. Found in professional communications, business letters, and presentations. Might use contractions but avoids slang. 4. Example. I've reviewed the report, and we need to address some issues. 5. Informal. Common in personal letters, text messages, and casual conversations allows for slang, idioms, phrasal verbs, and even regional phrases. 6. Example. Hey, I think that new cafe downtown is pretty cool. While all levels have their place, it's vital to recognize when to use which level, especially in academic settings. Always aim for formal or at least semi-formal language in your academic works. 1. Avoid contractions, instead of, don't, use, do not. 2. Avoid colloquialisms and slang. Phrases like, a piece of cake, or, hit the books, are informal. 3. Use passive voice judiciously, while not always preferred, passive voice can increase formality in some contexts. 4. Example. The experiment was conducted, instead of, we conducted the experiment. 5. Be cautious with pronouns. Avoid using first-person pronouns like, I, or, we, unless the guidelines specify. 6. Expand your vocabulary. Words like, ascertain, instead of, find out, or, demonstrate, instead of, show can increase the formality of your writing. And there you have it. Understanding and mastering levels of formality is crucial in academic writing. It not only enhances the quality of your work, but also ensures you convey your ideas with clarity and authority. We hope this video has shed light on the nuances of formality. Keep practicing, keep refining, and remember, the key is to always match the level of formality with the context and audience. Happy writing!